Yo, 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 it's your boy T. I don't really know what to call my show, man. I've been like trying to debate on what I should call it, what I should not call it. Um, I don't know, man, but I just know that I be having a lot to speak on. And I know what I be speaking on be shit that, you know, need to be heard. Some of y'all don't want to hear the truth. I don't give a fuck about none of that shit. If you don't like it, come find me. Fuck it. But, um, purpose, right? We're going to talk about purpose. Everybody need a purpose in life, right? Because without purpose, you have no motivation, no direction, no peace, and no pleasure. And purpose, purpose, once you have a purpose, or your, you feel like your life got some type of purpose, it brings so much joy to your life. So for instance, let's say you wake up every day and you ain't got no real like purposeful reason for being up in the morning. You might wake up feeling sad, miserable, down about yourself, right? But if you wake up with a purpose, when you got a purpose, man, look, it's really no limit when you have a purpose because it's like this. I, I'll give you an example. When I used to play basketball in school, right? Like elementary, all that shit, right? So, but what gave me the, the real passion and purpose for wanting to play for real was because I knew that if I was to go to the NBA, that could help my family, right? But what gave me real purpose was my grandma, right? My granny, right? Because granny symbolized everything that was real to me. You know what I'm saying? That was pure to me. You feel me? So when I say that, it's like the love that I got from her was just unmatched. You know what I'm saying? Like nothing could nothing could honestly like amount to that the type of love I got from her. So with me receiving so much love like I did, I, I found purpose in life to be like, you know, this lady deserved a world. She deserved it all. And that was my goal. That was my purpose. I was like, you know what? I'm going to the NBA. I'm going to make the most money ever. This was before LeBron and all, right? So I'm like, shit, I'm going to be the best ever. Because if I get rich, I know I got her to hold the money for me, take care of the money for me. Or just take care of anything that need to be taken care of money wise. Cause I'm gonna have, I'm gonna make the money. She go handle the money, right? But when she got cancer and died, I lost my purpose. Like literally, I lost it. Like it's, it was no motivation to want to do nothing really. Like I don't, I don't want to say I want to live, but I ain't want to really live for for a little while. Like not on some like I was suicidal or trying to harm myself or nothing like that. But it was just like, I ain't had that spark. I ain't had that purpose no more. I ain't had that motivation. I ain't had that, I ain't had that drive to want to be great no more. Cause like me, my purpose for wanting to be great was never for me. It was for everybody else. But when I felt like I lost my everything, I didn't want to do it no more. Cause it was like, I don't want to say I don't give a fuck about everybody else. But to a certain extent, I don't because they they created too many problems and too much issues in my life as far as like just my mental and how I felt as a person and stuff like. So you lose like your number one person and then it's like the whole world crash with you, right? I just recently found a new purpose in life. And that was like through my grandma from my dad's side. Like in the past year, I've learned that the same love that I got from my mama mama, I get from my daddy mama 
and probably a little bit more for real, honestly. Like, it's it's probably even deeper than it was for my granny, real shit. Like, so now I got purpose again. You know what I'm saying? Like, I got it again. It's like I got my I got my queen again. You feel me? So now it's like boom. I ain't playing basketball no more. So it's like okay, what you gonna do? Well, that's the pro that's been the problem right there. I don't know what the fuck I wanna do, bro. Like, I don't wanna, I don't wanna work. As far as like labor wise, but I wanna like, I wanna use me, I wanna use me to make money. So when I say I wanna use me to make money, like I wanna be able to talk to people, talk about deals, talk, negotiate plans, negotiate contracts and shit like that. I wanna be involved in shit like that, right? Plus. It's like, I feel like in some way, that's my purpose a little bit. Cause I got so many talented people around me, but it's for like, for honestly, the problem with all the talent that I see around me, none of them have proper management. None of them have proper management, whether that be because they'll be the ones that push the management away or whether that be like, they unmanageable or whether that be like, you know, they can't work out on a proper negotiation or something. But I personally feel like my purpose is to like assist those people that have trouble getting their talents to the people in a sense. So let's say I can see myself being like a a partner with big companies you know that person that come in maybe make a few challenges that can really really help a company for real you know what i'm saying i'm trying to work on this deal with a few different companies right now but like i said purpose is the key though without purpose a lot of shit ain't even possible <coughs> <coughs> so the message for the day is, if you don't, for whatever reason, have purpose in life, find your purpose. Or let it find you, but either way it go, try to recognize what your purpose is. Because I'm telling you, that's gonna change a lot about you and how you do things. That purpose gonna motivate you. That purpose gonna, you know, empower you. That purpose is gonna give you peace. You know what I'm saying? Like peace is, yeah, peace is beautiful. One thing anybody in the world I know for a fact, anybody in the world will want peace. And that's one thing that we as humans long for. We long for peace. We long for peaceful moments. And purpose is definitely a big key factor in that. So, for this video, the message is this. Find purpose. Because with that, you'll get motivation. You'll find direction. You'll find peace. And you'll find pleasure. But first, you got to find purpose. And like I said, I don't know what I'm gonna call this shit. We just go call it politic in your TV, man. So I wanna hear what y'all think in the comments, man. Hopefully I ain't have my hand over the microphone too much to where y'all can't hear me, but you know, please wake up today and look for your purpose. Write write a list. You know what I'm saying? Write a list of shit that you just feel like maybe you should be doing, could be doing, rather be doing, you know what I'm saying? Cause I ain't gonna lie, I like doing this shit. I like talking. I like interacting with folks, you feel me? So, get in them comments, smash that like button, make sure you share this shit. And if you if you trying to find your purpose, if you need help with that, I'm that guy. I'm very good at helping people find them. You know what I'm saying? And I, as far as this, it's up to them to listen. And I feel like my purpose won't be fulfilled until I can get people to start listening to me. 
like really really listening to me and taking me serious for real i feel like people listen to me but they don't take what i'm saying serious and if they do maybe they taking it too serious and they scared of the outcome for real and don't be scared of your purpose either but anyways it's your boy tig coming with the politics man and i'll be back again with another one dog